What's up guys, it's King Josh back with another video and today I've got some doubles gameplay for you guys and most of it is going to be post com but some of it is live commentary so I hope you guys do enjoy and let's get right into the video. Let's go, you see this Randy? So to start things off they actually scored a 3 and then they ended up turning the ball over which led to me getting an easy dunk and right after that Randy sauces this guy up, gets right past him and gets an easy dunk to go. Bro, what? I pump fake twice, what the hell? Right here, I was gonna set a screen for Randy, but he actually didn't want one. He pulls a deep three and he hits it. Next play, I decided to take it in the post. I spin right past this guy, get him jumping and get an easy dunk. So at this point, we're up three to nine. These guys can't seem to stop us. As you can see, Randy gets this guy jumping. He gets an easy dunk. We're up 11 to three. This guy can't stop my post spin, so I just take an easy reverse dunk. Me and Randy are just taking turns cooking. Like, look at this. He drives right past this guy, gets an easy layup. We're up 3 to 15. These guys cannot stop us at all. I'm going to take it into the post once again, spin right past him, get a dunk. And we're up 3 to 17. Randy got his takeover. He greens a deep three. We're up 3 to 20, and I'm going to let him hit another shot. He does miss, but I do get the rebound. I put it up, and that's going to be the game. So I finished with 10 points and 2 rebounds, and Randy finished with 12 points, 2 assists, and 2 steals. How did these make it to round 2? No, heavily contested. As you can see, Randy hit the first shot of the game, and look at this layup right here. Bro! I guess I missed because it wasn't a full bar, but anyway, Randy's gonna hit this guy with a nice hesitation, get both of them jumping on a mid-range pull-up, and make it. Oh my gosh, why'd I take the layup in? Why am I going for a pullback? 2K! 2K is really trying to mess with me. As you can see, I also don't get the steal there, but this guy takes a horrible shot. Shot clock was low, so I guess he had to take it. But anyway, Randy's going to give me the ball back. You guys know the usual. I'm going to go into the post, take a post hop shot, lightly contested, and I'm going to hit it. Very next play, me and Randy are going to get a really easy pick and roll. I don't know what type of defense they were playing on that. And speaking of defense, this guy could not play defense on me. I had him jumping over and over. As you can see, I got takeover. I'm going to get into the post easily, but I'm going to pass it out. I'm going to be unselfish. Randy's going to green it. We're up 16 to 0. And look at this. This guy's jumping. I'm not even doing anything special, but I got him jumping. Got him jumping again right there. I'm going to hit an and one. And since I had takeover at this point, I just wanted to keep taking it to the post. This guy wasn't jumping, so I put it up on him. And once again, look at this. He just plays really bad defense. He was in front of me, but then he just steps away. So I'm just going to take an easy layup. And as you can see, I had 14 that game. Randy had eight. Two more, Randy. Two more. Okay, if we lose this. So in this game, we just started off with an easy pick and roll. I got that guy caught on the screen. Randy's going to green the mid-range. We're up 2-0. to zero. And then I don't know why he pulled that deep three. I guess it was because I had the rebound. But they both crashed. He's open. And he hits a three. So at this point, we're feeling good about this game. Especially because this guy was 3-26. and 26, And he can't play defense. We're up 7-0 now. Look at this. Their screen defense is horrible. They don't know whether to stay back and guard me. Or to stay up and guard him. They just have no idea what they're doing. We're up 12 to 0. Look at this. This guy's post defense is horrible. I wasn't even making contact with him. I still did a post spin past him. Randy's going to pull a 3. He's going to green it. We're up 17 to 0. He has his takeover. And look at this. They don't know how to play defense. And I got my takeover. And this guy ends up quitting. So I'm just going to go into the post, take an easy layup, and end it. 21 0. Damn, that was easy. They didn't even get the ball once. So in the last game, we went up against a pro three. His record's not all that crazy, but his teammate, his record is ugly. So to start the game off, I don't know why this guy's doing a backflip. Randy's going to green a three, so we're up three to zero. And once again, I'm going to get Randy open for a three. He pulls from deep, he greens it. I guess pick and roll Maestro and limitless range works. And look at this. They think he's going to pull a three. He's going to get a nice backdoor cut. We're up eight to zero. I went to set him a screen, but he actually ended up driving. And I don't know why this guy jumped when I was on the three. I'm a playmaking post scorer, but on this possession right here, he actually played decent defense. I was trying to fake, but I accidentally faked one too many times. So they do end up getting the ball. Pure sharp, wide open for three. And he somehow missed it. How are you going to be a 93 overall pure sharp open on the three? wide open and miss it i don't understand but anyway i'm gonna slip right through the defense get a nice pick and roll to go and randy got his takeover from that and once again i'm gonna get a nice roll so we both have our takeover just like last game we're up 14 to 0 i'm just gonna post spin right on this guy he doesn't know what he's doing look at this he's jumping i'm dunking all over him we're up 18 to 0 randy's gonna take that i don't know why he took it they're gonna get the rebound you know glass cleaners have rim protector gold right that. And this pure sharp, I don't know why he took a fading three from kind of deep, but anyway, I'm gonna get into the paint 
And this guy, once again, cannot play defense. I took that in his face. Don't know why, but Randy's wide open, and that's going to be game. Damn, 221 overs. We had 221 overs in a row. So you guys can see the final steps right here. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I'm out. Peace.